Figuring out a person's real intentions can be pretty hard and often ends in disappointment and heartbreak. Luckily, there are a couple of surefire ways to spot a fake person in your life and cut them off before it's too late. So, let's get right into them. Number 1. Fake People Care About Other People's Social Status If you want to know what a man's like, take a good look at how he treats his inferiors, not equals. Remember this great quote from Harry Potter? That's exactly how you distinguish a fake person from a genuine one. When a person doesn't really care about their own gain, they pay zero attention to the social status of others, focusing on their personality traits and characteristics instead. A fake person, on the other hand, isn't interested in you. They're interested in what they can get from being close to you. Take the Harry Potter books, for example. While Harry never paid attention to Ron and Hermione's social status, Draco Malfoy always judged people based on how powerful or rich they were. So take a closer look at how they observe the people around them, and you'll see everything you need to know. Number 2. Fake People Manipulate Others Can you imagine a genuine and happy person trying to manipulate somebody? Not just doing a harmless manipulation, but using disgusting methods to make others do what's best for them no matter how bad it may be for somebody else? This is exactly what a fake person would do. The example of Lucy and Eustace from the Chronicles of Narnia illustrates this point very well. Lucy never tried to change others and accepted them as they were. Eustace chose to threaten people to get what he wanted. If you notice someone constantly manipulating you and your feelings, there's no point trying to make it work. Unfortunately, these toxic people will never give up their ways. Number 3. Fake People Crave Attention Genuine and confident people usually don't feel a burning desire to be the center of attention at all times. The reason behind it is pretty simple. They don't really care what society thinks of them. But with fake people, the situation is completely different. They feel like they're lacking something important, and they try to compensate for it by getting ahead of the game, no matter who gets hurt in the process. If you need an example, take a look at the second Shrek movie. Shrek never wanted to be popular in the first place and always did what felt authentic to him. His antagonist, Prince Charming, craved attention and was ready to break up a loving couple just to be noticed and get his way. Fake person behavior at its best. Number 4. Fake people never listen Fake people love to talk about themselves. If you meet a person who never asks about you and always makes every topic about themselves, you're probably dealing with a fake person who doesn't deserve your time and effort. There's a great cinematic example of such behavior in the recent hit To All the Boys I've Loved Before. You have Jen, Lara Jean's former best friend, who stopped their friendship right away and never really bothered to listen to Lara Jean's side of the story. Jen made the situation all about her. Then there's Lara Jean, who's a great friend and a genuine person, always ready to listen and offer support. It's not hard to figure out who's the fake one out of the two of them, right? Number 5. Fake People Love to Brag Someone's bragging is never fun to listen to. If you come across a person who can't stop talking about how awesome they are, there's a big chance you're talking to a fake person. Genuine people are proud of their accomplishments, but don't boast about them left and right. On the contrary, a fake person goes on and on and on about how beautiful, smart, and fantastic their personality, things, and smallest achievements are. The classic movie Beauty and the Beast does a really good job of showing this difference. There's the Beast, who's very intelligent and read numerous books throughout his life, but never really talked about it. Then there's Gaston, who always shows off, boasting about all the magnificent things he never actually did. Wise Disney knew that the earlier we learn this lesson, the better. Number 6. Fake People Break Their Promises Remember the classic Jane Austen book Pride and Prejudice? 
Everybody thought that Mr. Wickham was the most charming man in the world, but he turned out to be a fraud and a liar who never kept his promises. At the same time, Mr. Darcy, whom everybody hated from the beginning, showed himself to be a man of this world on multiple occasions. And that's another sign of a genuine person right there. If you keep hanging out with someone who talks big but always disappears when it comes to action, this is definitely not a person you can rely on. Do you really need friends you cannot trust? It's way better to keep your circle tight and make sure that the people around you always have your back. Number 7. Fake People Are Opportunists Genuine people love to spend time with you and will never throw a friendship or romantic relationship out the window. However, fake people see the situation completely differently. They're happy to be by your side, but only till they meet somebody with a higher status or more money. Even more so, they're not afraid to ruin your relationships to get the best you have. As always, I have a cinematic example for you. For this one, it's Chastity from 10 Things I Hate About You. She hung out with Bianca for a long time, but instantly forgot about their friendship once she could get closer to the popular guy, Joey, as opposed to Cameron, who genuinely loved Bianca. Not cool. Number 8. Fake People Put Others Down one of the most obvious signs of a fake person is when they try to look better at someone else's expense. This type of person never hesitates to criticize others harshly to make themselves appear cooler. The captain of Gondor from The Lord of the Rings, who always treated his servants and even his own son with disrespect, is a perfect example of that. Genuine people, on the other hand, try their best to uplift and inspire others. Just take a look at Aragorn who always supported those around him. So if your newfound friend or lover always makes offensive comments about others, it's a red flag you shouldn't ignore. Number 9. Fake People Feed Off Drama Fake people never care about someone else's feelings. Instead, they love to play people off against one another for fun and entertainment. Just look at what Regina George did throughout the whole Mean Girls movie, and especially toward the end, turning a whole school into complete chaos. Now, that's definitely not something a genuine person like Aaron or Damien would do, right? If you see your friend or partner constantly destroying the lives of others, don't think they'll never do the same thing for you. Once they get bored, you could easily become their next toy. Number 10. Fake People Gossip There's a great quote that says, Great minds discuss ideas, average minds discuss events, and small minds discuss people. And that's exactly where gossiping stands when it comes to fake people. Genuine people have high moral principles that don't let them talk behind someone's back. If they don't like you, they simply don't interact with you that often. But fake people prefer hypocrisy and often act all lovey-dovey with you while talking trash about you behind your back. James Cameron portrayed these two types of people perfectly in his hit movie Titanic with the unsinkable Molly Brown, a strong woman who wasn't afraid to speak her mind, and Rose's mother who enjoyed spreading rumors and judging others. Number 11. Fake people are only nice when they need something. The only focus of a fake person is themselves, so they view people from the perspective of what they can get from them. This hidden feature can be pretty hard to notice right away. Let's take the legendary Game of Thrones. If you were Robert Baratheon, you would probably never realize the real frightening nature of your wife, Cersei, who, in fact, was planning to kill you all along. And that's exactly what a fake person would do. Be nice and friendly to your face, but use you for their own good at the same time. Thankfully, there are more genuine people like Jon Snow, who's respectful toward everyone he comes across and always lets his feelings show when he isn't a fan of somebody. Number 12. Fake people disappear when you need them the most. 
Every single one of us has been in a difficult situation at least once in our lifetime. Sure, these situations are the worst, but they always show you who your true friends are since fake friends always disappear at the first sign of trouble. Remember Emma Roberts' movie Wild Child? When the main character Poppy got sent to the boarding school, she felt lonely at first and tried to keep in touch with her best friend Ruby. But Ruby forgot her in a minute, simply because she was no longer considered cool by the wealthy teen crowd. At the same time, the real friends Poppy made at her boarding school stuck with her through thick and thin. So, the old saying, a friend in need is a friend indeed, will never stop being true. How do you figure out whether a person is genuine or not? Tell us in the comments section below. Don't forget to give this video a like, share it with your friends, and click subscribe. Stay on the Bright Side!